What's going on everybody? It's your man Lyndon Britt. Want to hit you with another video to be able to give you a tip to grow your business today. Um, I'm out here at this beautiful, wonderful Wooden Lodge. I don't even know what city we're in right now. It was a two hour drive from where we are. And uh, the, the, the event for today is what caused me to um, make this video. I'm going to title this one, Courageous Pursuit. Courageous Pursuit. Now I was thinking, um, my wife is about to jump out of a plane. She's about to go skydiving. She's about to go skydiving. I want to go with her, but I don't. We, I don't meet the weight requirements. It takes a, a weight requirement of 220, and I'm a solid 280 right now. So unless I use 60 pounds in the next hour, it's not happening for me. But I want to shoot this video, and I, I thought about. I, I take everything and use it for the business aspect a lot of times, but courageous pursuit is exactly how you, it takes courage to jump out of a finely <laughs> running plane and call me crazy. Like I said, I want to do it too, but I, I've got a lot of work to do to be able to get that done, but it takes a lot of courage to do something like that. A lot of people have dreams and they're afraid to pursue them. It, you you have to pursue your dreams and your goals with a courageousness. Which it, it takes a lot of courage with courageousness. Yeah, I said it. <laughs> but <clears throat> my wife inspires me every day with the things she does, man. She's a wonderful woman. And I'm glad to see her following her dreams, doing a couple of things. She says it's on a bucket list. I said it's on a to-do list. That's what I... A bucket list is what you do before you get ready to die. I don't have a bucket list. It's on her to-do list. We It's a lot of things that we want to accomplish, and I'm not going to wait till I get ready to die to start doing stuff all on a bucket list. So, anyways. But um, it, it takes a lot of courage to do some things. And, and well, like I said, I put it in the business aspect. When you think about business, it takes courage to do the hardest part of starting a business. And what's that? Taking the first step. A lot of people, once you realize you can get past the first step, your business is already up and running. You started it. Hey, what, what, what else can go wrong? You know, I've been, I've been in my business. I can do this. I can do that. You realize, you realize, you're gonna face some, some trials and tribulations through trial and error kind of thing. Excuse me, my, my dog is jerking my arm. Um, but uh, you, you realize it's gonna be some things that you have to work on. It's gonna be some things that you have to work toward. It's going to be some, some hard things, some things as a business owner you're going to have to figure out. But you have to have the courage to take that first step. You have to. It, you absolutely must. Because if you don't, what I want you to think about what your life would be like if you don't take that first step to pursue your goals. If you don't take the first step, that first courageous step to pursue your goals, you're going to live your life with a bunch of what ifs, and I wish I would have, and I wish I could have. Why live like that? Why live like that? You've got to you you've got to really pursue your goals with the tenacity of 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 a honey badger, <laughs> as we would say in a MLSP. You got to you've got to really pursue your goals. Nothing can stop you. If you let anything stop you, it's it's yourself. You can't let other pe other other people's opinions stop you. You can't you can't even let your own mind beat you up. But you have to have the courage to really pursue. That's that's all I want. That's the only point I want to get across with this. It, you got I got to thinking about the the courage that it takes. Like I said, to jump out of a plane, and it takes a lot of courage to start a business. It takes a lot of courage to run a business. It takes a lot of courage to want to. Hit, for some people, because there are a lot of people in, in in our industry for selfish gain, it takes a lot of courage to step out and want to help other people outside of yourself. Because a lot of people want to know what's in it for me. But what if you were in business to ha ask people what's in it for them? What's in it for them? I want you to think about how many lives you could change if you thought about what's in it for them. Help them realize that their courageous step for the things that that courageous step that they need to take to accomplish things they want to happen is what you have to offer because what you have to offer can help them all right it's just something to think about so that that courageous you you got to have a courageous pursuit a courageous pursuit 
to be able to accomplish those dreams. Okay? So get out there. Find out what it is that you want to do with your life. And push toward it. Use that courage within you to push toward it. Start working toward that. Okay? Let nothing stop you. Alright? So I just wanted to shoot this short video for you. I'm sorry if you felt it was long. But um, I don't. <laughs> Anyways. But y'all have a blessed day. I'm about to go take a lot of pictures. A lot of videos. And I'll even let you see her when she comes down. I'll take some photos. And y'all can see... Um, I do, matter of fact, I do a live on Facebook. How about that? So, y'all make sure y'all check me out live on Facebook. Find me a uh, Lyndon Britt. All right. Y'all have a blessed day. And just just go out, go out there and encourage somebody today to step out on their courage and do something that they normally wouldn't do to pursue their dreams. All right. Continue to follow the blog, lyndonbritt.mlspsites.com. And y'all have a blessed day.